Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie, and I'm here with Zenrot. Hello. And we're here with the Sonic Mega Collection, because what other better way for there to have multiple Sonic games in one <laughs> for me to play? Um, Bro, this... I fucking love Sonic. Zen absolutely loves Sonic. I like Sonic in theory. In concept, okay, okay. I really like it. You know what we need to do? Because if you really hate the original games, you need to let me pick which game you play, and I'm going to pick a terrible one that I like and nobody else likes. From from this list right here, I don't think I actually have all the... You have to... This The set of Sonic Mega Collection, by the way, is very weird because you have to unlock them. So it's like Sonic the Hedgehog, Sonic the Hedgehog 2, Sonic the Hedgehog 3, Sonic and Knuckles... Sonic 3D Blast, Sonic Spinball, Dr. Robotnik's Mean Bean Machine. Sonic 3D Blast, that's the one, baby. Alright, this was originally going to be me just playing Sonic the Hedgehog because I wanted to see if I could beat all of Sonic the Hedgehog with you here. But now that you're here, the Sonic fan, you're going to give me the worst one. <laughs> it's, okay, it's so fucking bad, and I love it so much. It, it's one of those games that was like, who, who made this? Why'd you make it? But it's a special part of my childhood. <laughs> So, let's get into it, because I told when I told you I don't think Sonic is good, you actively gasped. It was like a, it was a strong, like, what? <laughs> I've never been felt so betrayed. Whoa, okay, no, Listen. Mind. this fucking intro. <laughs> yeah, bro, look at it. And look at that fat bird running behind this awful looking Sonic. Oh, oh I hope you can hear the music. You can, you can. Sonic 3 Blast. This is early days 3D2. Um, but yeah, I think it's because I didn't really start with Sonic until Sonic Adventure 2. So, because growing up, I was an Okay, Adventure. see, I started with Sonic 2 and Knuckles, so maybe that's why. Maybe I just grew up with it, so it was easier yeah, for me. I feel like it's very hard for a lot of people who grew up on the Super Nintendo to go back to the Genesis collection. I feel like the wounds are still strong. Fuck yeah, that. flickies. Look at these amazing Flickies. Flickies are mysterious birds. They live in another dimension and can travel anywhere through large rings. I actually think Flicky is in this collection, isn't it? Oh, uh, probably. It's Teddy Roosevelt Robotnik. <laughs> AKA peak Robotnik design. Robotnik learns about the Flickies. I will change the Flickies into robots and have them search for the Chaos Emeralds. Because that sounds like a good idea. Fuck. <laughs> This fucking Fuck snake. Fuck yeah, baby! Yeah! <laughs> the unmoving Sonic. <laughs> just, it's like the, the Sonic just contemplating the fucking fruitlessness of existence. <laughs> and meanwhile, these reject bugs that characters. <laughs> oh no, he's got him. Robotnik made my friends like this. I must stop them. Robotnik must be stopped. Sonic starts to defeat the enemies in order to rescue the Flickies who are trapped inside. Go, Sonic. You can warp through the big rings with the help of the Flickies. Chase after Robotnik and defeat his plans. How many levels is this game, Zen? Oh, so many. Oh my god, this feels bad right from the jump. It's it's so bad. Alright, let me see what my controls are. Okay, this is jump. This is to do the little spin move. I forget, what game introduced the actual like spin dash? Was that not until 3? Uh, Sonic 2? Sonic 2? Okay. 3? I want to say two. All right. Uh, do you know anything about the lore or history of this game, Zen? Because this feels like something of, that was of shit this out. specific game. Yeah. Um. It, it's just bad, basically. So Sonic wanted to try to get into 3D early. Mm -hmm. Um. And so it pushed. It was like, all right, we'll do we'll do Sonic 3D Blast, and it was doing it on a Genesis. <laughs> and as you can see, this was like. Because obviously the N64 is where, like, 3D got figured out, like, how to do it right. And, like, yeah. the PlayStation 1. Um, so, something I actually had to I had to talk with D3 a long time ago when we did a Glover video is that early 3D games are a trip because nobody knows how to make a 3D platformer. Because it's... Correct. Which is why, like, the best platformer of the PS1 era, which is most people... I don't agree with this, but most people say it's Crash Bandicoot, mm -hmm. is basically a 2D game from a different angle. Like... Yeah. It's not, not a real 3D game. It's no. 3D graphics on a 2D plane. Um, yes. I would agree with you. Because that. back in Genesis times and SNES times, when you tried to make a 3D game, this is what you get. Where there is absolutely no, like, stable perspective. Shit just flies all over the fucking place. 
Yeah. You can't figure out where you reside in comparison to anything else. It's really like I'm missing all these jumps and I, like look I, look at that. How many times does it get hit? That? Yeah, it's it is not an amazing feeling, especially with in with Sonic, who is so much about the speed of things. It feels like this is actually a problem that would eventually happen to the Sonic Adventure games too, where I'm going too fast and I'm outpacing the the actual screen. <laughs> And that's more okay somehow in 2D compared to 3D. Like in 3D, it's actually unbearable. God damn it! Oh no, you gotta get your birds back. Oh, shit! Did I really lose the guy. You lost bird? your birds. Come back here, you stupid fucking. There we go. The flickies. Oh my god. This is yeah. So that would explain. I forgot. Did this really release around? No, this is still in. This is way before N64 would be released, right? This is just early experiment. Uh, this was like movie. Sega Saturn time period, like where they tried to make that shit work. Okay. If I remember right, Sega Saturn doesn't actually have a um, a Sonic 3D game. They have now. This go game. stand on that. They have a port there of this game. Yes. That's fucked. If you ever wondered why the Sega Saturn failed so horribly, it's that it launched with no Sonic game. <laughs> It launched yeah. with dreams. <laughs> yeah, no, it launched serious. without Sonic. And then they tried to just immediately shovel out the Dreamcast right afterward, which, to their credit, did launch with Sonic. Yes, what it was needed. Funny enough, similar thing happened to the GameCube, where they thought, like, the good idea was to launch without a Mario game. Even though Luigi's Mansion kicks ass, like, you really shouldn't launch Yeah, but, like, that's still not a traditional, like, Mario style, even if it is in that world. Oh, no. your birds! Damn it, my one bird. Like, in general, you shouldn't launch your console without some form of, like, an amazing lineup game. How the fuck? Okay, let me look So, okay, so to do that, you need more birds, because the birds fly above your head, and anything the birds touch, you also get. What? Okay. 3D graphics, then. <laughs> oh, okay, so that's a shield. Okay, so when you get that, if you ever do... <laughs> okay, I'm going... Um, if you hit jump, like, oh, you lost it. <laughs> if you have a shield and you you hit jump twice, you get to use the special effect of what the shield is. Okay, let, let me, how the fuck did he hit me? If you'll notice it's that I'm... No, he's... Look at the 3D planes, then. He is above me. I am below him. That shot be, you should be That's going true. over me. That's true. You are below him, but this game doesn't give a fuck about that. Oh yeah, r go on that thing, and I think up I think Tails is up there. And if you give Tails enough rings, he'll let you go get a Chaos Emerald. Oh. I don't I don't see him up there right now, so I'm gonna assume get more flickies right now. The sound design. There also... there's some he's somewhere. Yeah. Tails and Knuckles are in like every level, and when you find them, you can give them rings, and they'll they'll take you to the Chaos Emeralds. All right, cool. I will find them, assuming I do not die at some point. This is the hard. God, re I'm not trying to. This isn't a bit. This is me legitimately trying to play the game. <laughs> uh, yeah. Early. Oh, you're right. I can see now the flickies going that way. At least they've been pretty generous with lives, as far as I can tell. Yeah, it, it's hard to game over in this unless, like, you just get really fucked. Yeah. I give them th uh, that much at least. Alright, let me see if I can approach this guy. Can I just... No. That was what I get for trying. I was gonna say, it might be easier to just run into them and press this button than it is to actually, like, attack them. God fucking damn it. Okay, let's go. Alright, I don't know. We're, we're doing fine. Early... A little bit early losing there at the beginning, but I feel like I'm in a much better place now. God damn it. <laughs> I shouldn't say anything. <laughs> Where are the last two of these guys? So yeah, I never grew up They're with somewhere. Sonic stuff. I did have this collection because it was released on GameCube. I feel like I always gave a try to Sonic, but I feel like just something about his games never... Oh, uh, invincibility! Oh yeah. Hell yeah. Come on, okay. I was about to say, if I cannot kill... Listen this to this invincibility song. <laughs> the music sounds like it's drunk. <laughs> No, no tails up here, as far as I can tell. That is... It, it, this... It cannot be over. He's somewhere. He's, like, behind a rock. There's one of those spinny things that shoots you into a rock that's blocking some of the wall, and you break through it. Are you sure it's on level one? 
It's in Green Hill Zone. I don't know if it's this very first portion of Green Hill Zone or not. Yeah, Flicky Buddies. Okay. I'll keep an eye out on it. But for now, I'm going to deliver it. I'm going to dunk it into the ring. Dunk the Flickies. Yeah, dunk the Flickies and get... Look get at that! Moving. <laughs> Time taken. gets beamed up into fucking space. He does. Pretty good. <laughs> Green Hill Zone. Act 2. Alright. Oh, man. Alright, go in here. Go in here. Get these guys. The kids these days will never really understand how we'll, what we went through to enjoy video games. <laughs> the games that were released <laughs> that were this. Because back in the day, there wasn't, like, there were reviews, but most of the reviews were, like, owned by, like, Sega. Like, not in the case of, like, God, they paid them off. It was more like, welcome to Sega Magazine, owned by Sega. <laughs> the one-stop place uh -huh. to get your Sega reviews. <laughs> Um, similar to Nintendo Power, like this, uh, Nintendo did too, just not to make it seem like I'm specifically saying only once I did it. Everyone yeah, well, all, it. all gaming magazines were like that. It was like, gaming magazine by company. Hey, the best games? Ours. Yes, and they would Highest re reviewed games? Ours. Of course. It always felt like, eh, did this game really deserve that high of a cost? Yes. <laughs> it seems like a little bit too generous for what it was. Um... So, if you were a kid and you said there's a new Sonic game, like, you were buying this. Because especially with, yeah. the, with the Genesis, the way it was. Oh, you need one more bird. Also, I'm pretty sure you can't have more than three lives, so. Are you, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> I'm pretty sure you can only have three lives, Max. Wait, go, go to the right. Go to the right. Go to the right. All the way to the right. Yeah, you can only have three lives. There's no excuses for this, though. <laughs> okay, so that I think is where you come out from where Tails is. I think I think okay. it's up there. So go down and around to the right. Down and around. Right, yeah, down and around. Keep on keeping on till you can get over there. Sonic, please. God damn it! I don't know where he is. He's here somewhere. That little fucker. And I really want you to see him because his animation is so funny. He looks so bad. I think there might be a second part to the stage similar to the part one of the other thing. So. We'll go oh, you're missing a, a flicky. Am I missing a flicky? Yeah. Where? Oh, also, if you stand still, they'll circle you. Aww. <laughs> Finally, good <laughs> detail in this game. I think that's adorable. Whatever happened to the flickies? Why'd they stop using them? I feel like they were a hot thing for the majority of the 90s. And then, huge fall off in the Sonic lore. Shit. Oh, right there. There he is. God damn it. Get over here, you fucking... My rings! I had so many, and now I have nothing. I'm gonna show up with Tails of fucking five rings. Alright. Let's move on to the next part. Of this. Sonic, please! <laughs> Stop! This is the other thing about this game that maybe is not super apparent, is that Sonic goes from 0 to 60 in like 3 seconds. Yes. Like... It's like 3 steps, and he's at just sprint. All right, here's where he is, base power. Two seconds, and he's already at full tilt. Oh, he's there's already... Knuckles. Oh, shit. <laughs> Look at him. Look at him. Is he going to shoot? Yeah. <laughs> Put the fist up. Yeah, flash the knuckles. Hello, 16. He needs, he needs I think, 50. 50. 30 or 50. Okay. So you gave him 16, so now you need to get more. But also, you gave him every ring that you have. So now if you get hit, you die. Good design. <laughs> Similar to how it works in the actual <laughs> Sonic games. Where after you open the Chaos Gate, you lose all your rings, right? Yep. I'm still kind of Yeah, once you get 14, go back to... Alright, go back to Knuckles. Right. See if you can get that Chaos Emerald. But so you also... can see the special stage. I need to see the special stage. Here, Knuckles. Take 14. 30? Okay, I need to get to Damn it, he wants 50. So much in this economy? You're asking for too much, Knuckles. I know, just for one Chaos Emerald? I don't know about that, man. And I'm gonna have to do this seven more times if I'm gonna want the super special awesome ending. I can't imagine how Supersonic plays in this 3D plane. It would have to be actively horrible. It had to be like Smash Brothers Brawl levels of, uh, what am I doing with my life? <laughs> Trying to control 3D Sonic. Alright, there we go. It is easier to just kind of run right ahead into him than to actually try and fight him. 
Do I have to fight Okay, this guy? so now you have to stand underneath that guy and jump up into his head as he jumps over you. Uh, his head, right? Yeah, do it from underneath. Oh, from underneath. So, like, jump straight up. Not yeah, there you go. Now I lost all my fucking rings. God, I need yep. to not do that. Okay. Otherwise, I need to destroy myself in order to... To start get... over, yeah? Yeah. Oh, no. I thought it was a shield. I thought it nope. was a shield. Even faster! Oh, my God. Why? There we go. Okay. I am trying. Oh, my God. There we go. Okay. Realness. That's the rock where Tails is. I think you can spin dash into it and break it. Right here? To the right. Right there. Charge up your spin dash all the way and do it in the direction of that. Whee! There you go. Yeah. All right, I got 20. We go back to Knuckles. All the way back to Nux. All right, back to Knuckles. Just like this. Super easy. <laughs> Damn it. Alright, thankfully there's some rings here. But I have to be careful because if there's tails, that means that I could accidentally give this to tails. Oh, there he is. I can't give these to you, Tails. What are the what is 3D Tails looking like? Doing his absolute best, I'll tell you that much. Yeah, okay. look at him. Doing so his he's best. 30. Tails is 30. Knuckles is 50. You think so? Okay. I'm pr I'm 90 percent sure. Yeah. No, there you go. You I'm lied wrong, to me. Now we don't <laughs> get anything. We get nothing, Zen. <laughs> I don't have any rings to give to both of these motherfuckers. I'm so sure one of them was 30. Oh my god, the economy. It's so bad. I just want a Chaos Emerald. Well, I think the stage isn't done yet. I still have to look for two more of them, so hopefully there's more. Yes, here's some more. Okay. You need 19. It's 19 for... Uh, tails. tails. Oh, shield too. Get that. Ooh, shield. That's good to keep me protected. Yeah. Wow. And I think, is... I think if yeah. you jump and hit again, you bounce. <laughs> Do you? It looks like it's just a hard knockdown. Like he's a fighting game character. He's like, like he's in Marvel vs. Capcom 3. He's trying to do the hard, <laughs> uh, the quick get down. All right. Let's go to Tails. See if he can give us a nice little chaos emblem, or at least a special stage. Okay, almost there. Good game. There we go. Okay. Huh? Yeah, touch him. I am touching him. There we go. I wasn't touching him good enough. There it goes. All right. Oh fuck this. Oh wait, actually this is. <laughs> This might be better than the base game. <laughs> what? <laughs> How? Never mind, I take it back, I take it all back. Oh my god, this is like Crash Bandicoot, but bad. <laughs> Gotta get 50! Oh, no, Alright, now don't get hit. I have to beat the stage too? Oops. Now get 100. What happens if I lose here? I can't then you just it. don't get the Chaos Emerald. Okay, I have 100. I need to get more for the next one so I can... Okay. Safe strats. Safe strats. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Okay. Safety strats. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Oh, yeah. Now yeah just, just stay safe. Just stay safe. Oh. Chaos Emeralds. Oh. Got it. Hopefully I can keep those <laughs> rings so I can I love it. that! It just flies into the sky. <laughs> <laughs> you really do just be zooming out of here. Chaos Emerald get. Alright. Oh, and it resets so I can give these to Knuckles. No, no. No, Tails it. took him! God damn it, Tails. Money hungry. <laughs> it's what he is. 
But yeah, now I think it must have reset all your rings, so now you can get a bunch and give them to Knuckles. Yeah, it also reset my shield. Thanks a lot for that one. I can't have shit, <laughs> apparently. Uh, wait, there's an invincibility thing here, though. Ooh, I wonder if that Dave, the reason they reset is because I bet you Knuckles will have to, I have to get the full amount for Knuckles again. Oh, I, you're probably right. I bet you that's what's happening here. Okay, let me quickly run back to Knuckles. <laughs> By first activating everything in my way. Ooh, Flicky. Which way was Knuckles? Is it down here? Back toward the beginning. Uh, is he down here? I don't know if the answer is yes. No. But here's a shield. Knuckles. Knuckles. Right here. Alright, here you go, you just. 89, baby. What do I do for this one? Collect 50 rings, but this time there's a red background. <laughs> but yeah, but this time you're in Lava Bridge. Oh, shit. Okay, okay. Instead of Space Bridge. This... This takes all the fun out of the Sonic Special Zones. Okay, so you don't lose all of them if you get hit. That's good to no, know. No, you just lose some. Good, because I was going to say... Oh, God! That was close! It was very close. Clutch. I can't wait to see this in the new Sonic 2 game. I assume this is... Lore. It's gonna be yeah. This is what the whole movie is. <laughs> Sonic in a special stage. Oh, I, oh, I, you I didn't make it. it. Oh, special. Now stage you gotta go play. get him fifty more rings. All right. Well, Flickies, hold on because we're gonna about to be here forever. Let's go get. <sighs> All right. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Seems kind of cruel to put a <laughs> fucking bomb <laughs> right where Knuckles is. <laughs> where you have zero rings right afterwards. <laughs> yeah, my bird is freaking out at me too. Because I can feel the anger rising. Okay. And I have to get the fucking flickies again? God damn it, this game is so you know there's gonna be at least one guy defending this. One guy saying this game's actually a masterpiece, how dare you? Definitely in the comments, yeah. Sonic fan, who's the war, he's like the guy in Vietnam who the war never ended for him and Sonic is still needed to be defended. Oh, maybe it's because my bird's name is also Sonic that's there freaking out as I continue to Oh, they hear Sonic. you saying it. Yeah, that could be it. Where? Oh, okay, I have to go in through here, right? Yeah, yeah, go back up. Yeah, this should be fine. I don't think you can hear the bird right now, right? I can't hear the bird, for what it's worth. Okay, good. I'll oh! try... Oh, there we go. I don't know how those bombs hit you sometimes, and sometimes they don't. Okay, try again. Do you think I have to collect the thing from Tails again? Oh, God, I don't know. Really is a good idea to get as many rings as you can at the beginning stages here. Yeah, you wanna you wanna overdo it. Oh god. This is giving me ice strain. <laughs> like doctor the this is, should be forbidden by the Geneva Convention. They should take a look at no! what you hit a thing right at the end! I did. That was the game coming back from my comments against their the war crimes of Sonic 3D Blast. God. Okay. Yeah, the way to go is to get them early. Oh, thank God. Please say I have both. Please say I have both. Okay. We're good. Alright, let's finish the stage. Let's go find our flickies and, and the stage and the- Oh! oh. How? <laughs> How is my question to that not get me? <laughs> that was basically... Look at how shitty this is. You can't just like run through the rings. You have to stop and like sidestep slowly into each one. I do. This is my favorite game of all time. Fuck Final Fantasy VII. It's this. <laughs> it's this, Final Fantasy VII, the end statement. Yeah, it's, it's, it's this, Final Fantasy VII, Majora's Mask, <laughs> but nothing compares to Sonic 3D Blast.
nothing does really. They just don't make uh, bad games like this anymore. <laughs> no, ones, this is like... one of those games, yeah, that's like, like unabashedly shit. Yes, there's the... nothing good about this. Absolutely, but I love it so much. Qualities. This thing was because this is back when video games were like the wild west. Like you just did whatever the fuck you wanted, and you're like, make that. Yes, someone said to them, we want 3D Sonic on the Genesis, and the seven developers said, what? And then the Sega dudes went off to go collect their money. <laughs> that is yep. what happened on the development of this video game. And then either Yuji Naka was involved or not. Every time Yuji Naka is not involved, usually the games are shit, but that's also because Yuji Naka is specifically trying to destroy the game from within because it is not something he made. <laughs> <laughs> because he had, like, zero chill back in those days. <laughs> He chilled out over time, <laughs> but he, he kind of was a dick during those early days. Dude, he missed every single one of those rings because of fucking 3D perspective. Oh, yeah. I also feel like sometimes... So if you actually stay on the slope, I think you automatically fall down. See, as he's... I'm yep. not moving yep. right now. Yep, you're, you're getting down. That's insane. That's insanity. Who developed this? Why? It kind of reminds me of how... Um, in early fighting games, the combo system of Street Fighter 2 was a complete mistake. And yeah, it just it, accidentally happened that way. Yeah, it just accidentally happened that they created the fundamentals of what makes a good fighting game by accident. Um, and that, that was the joy of just creating something like that. Okay, let me end this goddamn level. Is there a boss fight here? Yeah. Get ready for it. Wait, what? Is there really a third part to this? You gotta be shitting yep. me with this. How many levels are in this fucking game? There's like eight, I think. Eight, okay. But I mean eight zones, so you're in zone one still. Where do I go from here? Okay, here. It's probably much easier if you're not trying to get the KO. If you're not going for the 100% route like I am. And getting... <laughs> and getting the Chaos Emerald as well. Come here, you piece of shit. There we go. Uh, so yeah, there was a lot of fighting games that were released post-Street Fighter 2. That, are that didn't like, give you a life. Really? That did not give me a life? No, you saw two. Oh, that's sad. This is not looking good. <laughs> This is looking actively bad for our, the chances of us beating this game. Oh, sick combo. Oh, we're gonna do it. You think so? <laughs> oh, yeah. Get one more ring. Ah, oh, damn Fuck, it. Fuck, you're at 99. No! <laughs> Off to space with you. <laughs> Act two. Time taken too long. Fuck you! <laughs> Fuck off. Time taken. We're not even gonna measure that shit. God. You <laughs> yeah, okay, so you have to get on the highest part and then jump and hit Eggman. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, of course. And he doesn't come down any farther? Oh, there he is. There you go. Yeah, he comes down to pick his stupid thing up. God damn it. Oh my god. I can't believe that they looked at the, the they said this is a collection of some of the, the Sonic greats, and they had the balls to include this. Alright, alright. Right. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm not even playing any of this up. If you're gonna accuse me of that, just know that I'm not. Yeah, also, if you don't hit the glass, he doesn't take damage. So if you hit, like, the metal portion on the side, it doesn't do anything. Come on. There's no way you would have to take more than three hits. What if? What about the rule of video games? Did Mario teach you <laughs> nothing? Oh, you missed. Like broad side of a bar, and I hit. Some of these coins also automatically despawn, by the way. So you actually can't... Careful! Okay. Careful! Right. Okay. I have to be careful with what uh, ring. Yeah, just try to get like one at a time. Ah, uh, fuck you! Oh, thank God! With one ring. 
Sonic got through. Like they, I like that they don't say that you finished. You got through it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You you managed it. Like war, the rusty ruins. We will be right back with more of this piece of shit video game. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you guys next time. Say goodbye, Zen. Goodbye, everybody. Keep watching this.